Hey guys, what's up? This is Ads from Shisha Bros, and we're in the Shisha Engineering Lab. Um, and we're going to be making a lot more content and videos uh, as per you know many of your guys' requests, and as well as uh, you know just getting some info and insight out there. Uh, you know, all in the name and passion of hookah. We love it. We're passion driven. Um, as I've mentioned in many other videos, if you may have heard or watched them, um, you know, we're not primarily here just to make money or, you know, a business is a business, but we're there, you know, just as much for uh, being a part of your number one sesh and definitely the broader hookah community of South Africa and the growing and evolving diverse culture of uh, hookah. Um, so today, we're just going to do a kind of like unboxing video as well as a uh, look and insight into the original cloud uh, products um, because one of the other things uh, that we've been getting through in our feedback is that many people have actually believed or were under the uh, impression that they have or were getting the original one. So. Look, we're not here to put anyone else down or any other business or, uh, you know, hookah uh, suppliers out there down. But, um, as I said, we will only sell or list and do things on stuff that you will, will know exactly and 100% um, <clears throat> exactly what they are, whether they are original or replicas or we don't know or whatever it is but you know that's the way we operate and uh you know you, you guys must give us your insight and feedback uh also let us know through your comments you know if you want to ask any questions even video requests you want to know about any other product you want us to do um kind of an overview and review and look into certain products uh we will definitely uh try and do that and we will be releasing many videos going forward. We are producing some content uh, similar to this uh, with packing techniques and uh, different ways of using, you know, uh, the hookah accessories out there, the different charcoals, coconut coals, natural, um, everything. We're going to just try and get a lot of things out there. Uh, and we are working on, th on those requests that have already come through. Anyway let's go through guys now in south africa when we initially received cloud products <clears throat> or the lotus uh we got this one here first right um and obviously the the box looking very similar to the original first cloud um, anybody would have thought it is but in fact this is not all of ours in the uh south african market right here are not in fact original uh, they are mostly replicas. I have not seen an original one in the past like five, six years. Um, and on that note, of course, uh, Shisha Bros are the official and only online retailers and distributors uh, in South Africa that actually have the original one, um, you know, for proper retail, etc. And you can confirm everything, or you should, you know, if you are concerned about the getting the original and making sure that it is you can contact the cloud interaction team in the u.s and they will let you know yes so i just got these here to give you a quick insight um look the full video will also be up uh, which you can check so yeah this is a quick run through hmd stands for heat management device if you don't already know and uh, that is basically um, you know obviously for the function of heat management and traditionally heat management on your hookah or shisha or with your sesh is your foil and your holes and your coals you know the heat delivery you know how many holes you you, you make all those things how big uh, there's so many different like factors and uh, ways and people have developed you know almost every single person has a bit of a unique touch to the way they make their hookah uh, you know for those that smoke a lot and um, yeah and, and, and enjoy the whole process it's not just smoking but believe 
you know, believe uh, it or not, <laughs> it's also the actual whole process of milking your cup and then getting into the session, you know. There's a certain, um, I don't know, ambience and um, feel and, you know, kind of sets the mood, um, you know. So, yeah. Anyways, um, <clears throat> so heat management device and basically what this does is it eliminates your need for your manual or traditional heat management where, you know, sometimes people just want to smoke uh, but it burns or something's happening and it's not tasting good or, you know, the, the, there's not enough heat, there's not enough smoke and then you got to play around with it and stuff. Now, most of you who've been smoking for a long time, and even those who are recent, um, you know, m will find their little way, as I said, and it will continue to evolve, etc., etc. You know, um, however you make it and pack it. And then also the other thing is the tobacco, how wet, how dry, the fine cuts, the loose cuts. And then, of course, the actual bowls being funnel or traditional Egyptian, you know, with the five, six holes at the bottom. Um, glazed, unglazed, all these things, you know, kind of have a little bit of a uh, significance uh, to the overall and full sesh. So, yes, what a heat management device does or is intended to do is to spread heat evenly amongst the uh, bowl or on, you know, or, or all of your flavor packed in a bowl. And that will give you a consistent uh, smoke and taste uh, as well, quality of your sesh. Uh, is, is what we're looking at so the taste will be consistent throughout and obviously it's a cooking effect not a burning effect right so even with foil you know you, you maybe a lot of you know but you know one of the fundamental basics no matter you know your preference and the way you pack is that either you have a, a, a two to four millimeter space in between the level of your flavor and the top of your cup where your foil will sit um, and again, same reason, you want it to cook, the cup must heat up, you don't want it to burn, you know, you're not frying the stuff or frying it. But then again, obviously there's the overpack methods and, you know, that's very much like traditional kind of style, Arab style, as well as some of the tobaccos, dark leaves, you know, especially like the tangiers, black lava, all those, um, you know, where they have certain dense pack uh, and kind of where the foil literally sits on or is sitting on the bed of flavor so of course uh, there are those but for the most part uh, you know the space between your foil and your flavor uh, level is what you want to achieve okay great now uh, <clears throat> you will obviously adjust the heat uh, delivery and airflow uh, through certain methods like the clouds will have those there, you know, and as you're smoking it might be too hot You pull it off or you let more air in or it might not be strong enough. You close it once again That's your preference if you like a hard draw with a you know uh, High intense burn on your flavor for a shorter period then you know, that's what you do uh, so you'll find your way and your niche uh, kind of method whatever you want to call it awesome so basically the way it works guys fundamentals again uh, you, you know this shouldn't be embedded on top of your flavor when you pull this off you shouldn't see flavor stuck all around you and basically you want to have it one millimeter from the edge of the stud okay one millimeter or two is where your flavors should sit okay so and you can measure that with uh, these glass ones especially because you can see where it actually comes out and yeah you'll get that over time look i've also made the mistakes that's the way you learn and you can see mine it literally just starts becoming like this but i thought this was the normal way so i used to pack it quite a bit and then you know pull off this and then i often used to have a lot of overwhelming taste and flavor and it's so strong and it's hitting me like that and then it you know burns uh, quite quick into it so you know that's uh what advice I can help or offer you based on those experiences and yeah so cloud had the initial version which was just the Lotus which looked like this had a bottom handle in that and you know this was the initial Samsara's design it's just f plain silicone with the ridges there and that would sit something like like that 
and then what they did was they made the the Lotus uh, the you know the version one but the plus uh, which looks something like this here and no handle at the bottom and as you can see that makes it much better because you know it's actually embedded or seated so nicely in there so definitely more like a ergonomic and uh, complementary design to their bowls and you know what's cool about it or cloud most certainly if it's an original one you know you should be able to do that obviously over time as you smoke that might not be the case but that's how you sh it should sit okay so those are all copies fakes replicas whatever you want to call them and you know as long as the people you got them from or the stores you got them from inform you of that you know it's not cool that they're selling these things under the pretense of something else so yeah they would sell the hookah <laughs> or shisha community out for money like you know and that's that's what i mean when we say we passionate driven and we're not for that type of i don't know business model okay so the bowl guys just to get this straight this is an hmd okay it's a heat management device that's the general term this specific one is called the cloud you get the ignis you get so many others um so that's just to clear up this is the name or the glass and silicone hybrid bowl right originally designed and made by cloud um and yes so that is what they call the samsaras so the samsaras or version one or just normal samsaras is that there okay uh full silicone with the ridges and then you get the samsaras vitria bowl which is the hybrid glass silicone ridges in there removable glass and then you get the vitria 2 which is a enhanced and better version um to set your cloud in all right so first things first we're going to go with the lotus cloud or sorry with the cloud lotus plus now the cloud lotus plus as i said it's still like a version one uh, it's just like improved and enhanced design and if it's original which this is and this is also an unboxing as i mentioned I will show you exactly how to know if this is original or not. Firstly, you can already see by the packaging, the quality of the packaging, uh, all of that stuff there, that, you know, the original is pretty class and elegant. It's design, packaging, all of that. Very, very detailed. So, we get that there. The other thing is, you will receive a card with every single uh, cloud device, right, that will have your serial number which you can register on the uh, cloud us site which is a limited lifetime warranty that already you know uh, speaks volumes in terms of the original versus the uh, copies okay and then it's a nice little sponge there so this is the plus remember the other design enhancement is that the plus is bigger so a little bit wider uh, for the space of the coals as well as a little bit taller to fit more bigger coals in and seat them nicely also the ridges in here promote airflow so the flow the charcoal doesn't go like black underneath very quickly which you know some charcoals do with the coconut and then of course guys you, you know this is not gonna really work with quick light uh, you know you have to you have to use natural coal coconut coal uh, yeah, most quick lights are not going to work on this. And you can see the design of the original um, Lotus uh, Plus. Really elegant, awesome. Um, got your good airflow there. Engraved uh, logo. And yeah, just really awesome. So that is the original Cloud Lotus. Then the Samsara's Vitria 2. Once again, class packaging, the way it's packed and serial number which you will register with your um, samsaras the other thing guys is this is much bigger than the first design the logo is over there uh, it's also a removable glass okay and uh, the, the other thing with original cloud samsaras virtues and these it ships out by cloud themselves that is the requirement and what they give each and every customer um, is a second free in a glass pot so that also you know 
these are all the value adds of the original so <clears throat> compared to like the first version you can see it's a, a lot smaller right it's a lot smaller the first one and your HMD would sit just over there so not on the like there's a little silicone bedding on there but it would sit like that awesome now with this here the way they've designed it is there's three different ridges in here so it's wider it's not necessarily more flavor it's actually very, the, the, it's like the same size actually um, and so it, you know it's not like you have to put a whole lot more flavor it's not bigger in that sense but now the first and second ridge form a bed perfectly perfectly seating the cloud as well as so that was the first design enhancement that you know this adds the plus and this uh, vitria too and the second thing is obviously it seats so well you know it's not easy to knock off uh, once it's sitting in there but the other thing is it's not sitting on a bed of silicone that's also what they wanted to kind of uh, eliminate um, you know due to the session smoke uh, taste sometimes not that it does taste or anything or it's just a better I would suppose uh, and yeah so it sits quite snug in there and you see you know, it's not easy to knock off so that's also how you would know knock off get it <laughs> anyways that's it guys unboxing of the cloud lotus plus original okay it's up and on sale at shisha bros the original one uh, of course we are getting the cloud lotus 2 so that's the brand new version just been released on 11th of november uh last week i think 2018 so yeah we're gonna get those in pretty soon pre-orders are open it's gonna be way cheaper through pre-order so check it out also guys give us your insight and you know let us know what hmds you got and we'd be very interested in checking those out have a good one guys happy sessions from shisha bros and stay tuned for other awesome videos That's me, ads from Shisha Bros. You can check everything out at store.shishabros.co.za or contact us, Instagram, Facebook, any, any of the channels. And we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Happy sessions.